What you doing, frugal? I am changing a crankcase filter on my truck. A crankcase filter. Yeah. So, we've already removed the bolts in this piece. Didn't even know this was there. It's funny, Billy, if you're watching this, was this what you were talking about? He just said something to me recently if I had to take it into the shop to get something at 67,000 miles. And I was like... And you have how many? 100,000. To do that. So I you're, watched the video, so now I know what I'm doing. Your service light came on. Yeah, it says perform service. Perform service. It doesn't say anything else. And so went to YouTube and they said you need to replace this filter. And you just saved a hundred dollars a screw. Yeah, one of the guys says they were gonna charge him eight hundred dollars to replace this filter. I'm like we can do that. Yeah, it's just eight screws. If we can get this. Oh, I need to take this off. I'm going to take this off. So off. That was keep it. That wind's going to. Thank you, YouTube. Thank you, YouTube. Do it yourself, YouTube. Alright, let's make sure I got the right one. This is the filter. That's what you're changing out? Yeah. And that's on. That's what I'm going to try to change out. Right there. You look. <laughs> Ew. Nasty. Now they're gonna be the one I'm gonna put in is white. Let me go get it. Earlier I was helping Jenna and she handed me what was the tool you handed me? A socket. A socket wrench? Or yeah. just a socket socket wrench with the socket in it. The first thing I did was drop it down in the hinge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one job. One job. There's a gasket right here, too, but it feels pretty good. I, I wouldn't know. All right, let me get the filter. Looks That's the same, doesn't nice it? and clean. Look at that. See the white? The filter? Oh, wow, yeah. Said to oil these, but um, don't have any clean oil. You want me to go back to my rig and get mine? No. Make it easier to slide down in there. So I got this set. O'Reilly's. O'Reilly's. Oh, I, yeah. I match checked. It was $165, I think. And I was looking at it online, and those other stores were cheaper, and they match checked it. So I got it for $116. Can you believe that? Woohoo! Better right. than paying $800. All there is to it. Little ring. Okay. Eight hundred dollars, please. You need me to take the dipstick back out? Not yet. We need to put the other uh, 
bolts in before we put that cover on. Okie doke. Going back in with the bolts. The TV, the TV, the YouTube video said 10 minutes. That's about right. I know. It's not bad. If I'd have had a ratchet wrench. Ratchet wrench? Ratchet wrench. Wrenches have been faster because the back ones, the back ones are hard to get to. So that's the other job I had. I had more than one job. I was supposed to bring my special tools. <laughs> and I was late getting here because I kept looking and kept looking and kept looking for it. It was here already. I forgot. <laughs> Plastic, so you don't want to do this too tight because then you crack it. Then you had to buy a whole cover for it. And I'm doing alternating just because I think it's a good idea. <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah, you don't want to crack it like that one mechanic did my cover. And he went, oopsies, you're going to have to get a new screw. Oh, I know. He broke the, the head off the screw. Yep. Just like that. There was one in the back, wasn't there? The yeah, I have to use the... Open and wrench because I can't get to it with the socket. I almost have to do that one by braille. Yeah. Come hold it. The video I watched there was an electrical cord tied to it. And you had to, which I thought it was that one back there, but I was like, that doesn't even look like it's attached. And it went. One hundred and sixteen dollars. No labor. Pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. I wish I had one of them socket rocket. <laughs> socket rocket. <laughs> socket wrenches. Ratchet wrench. Ratchet wrench. Needs to be changed. Definitely needs to be changed. It does say oil change due. And we didn't lose any screws. Nary one. That's cool. <laughs> so that's how you do it. That's it. Yep. Get out. Job done. Now I just need to go 
started and see if the... <laughs> Can you get any closer? <laughs> Start it and see if the code or the thing went away. If yeah. not, then you can manually turn off that. But one video I saw, it went off by itself, and then the other videos, they had to turn it off. Cool beans. Let's go see. I'll run this shirt. <laughs> yeah, run this shirt. And look, I thought I got rid of this. What is that? It's an air pump. I could. We'll change do, and then it would come up right after this one. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> All right, so I'll do the manual. Okay, so at the end of that other YouTube video that I watched, to get rid of the service performance, or ser perform service uh, code, you turn on the key, but don't start it push the brake twice and then push the gas twice and they said do the gas slowly twice so let's do that one two one two and then turn it off all right let's see if it did it now i do have the need to oil ch uh, change the oil so that's going to come up first and then it would come up perform service so let's see if we got rid of it there's the oil change due and then it would come up right after this yay <laughs> All right, 10, 15 minute job. Saved $800. Yeah, because that, well, I said that. Oh, I can't believe that. Dr. Frog, did we do a good job? Have you been waiting a long time here?